Mama Circus here with Jolene. Say hi, sweetie. It's my baby girl. Yeah, it is my little munchin. Yes, it is. She has been home for two weeks now from the hospital and doing well. Look at her, she's looking so good. We are gonna give her a bath today and then she's probably gonna go down for a nap, we hope. And then I am gonna uh, start doing some Monday cleaning. And yeah, so I'm gonna take you guys along with us today. Let's get our week started, have some good cleaning, and then also we're gonna make a delicious dinner. I'm gonna make um, chicken pesto pasta, it's really good. And yeah, and then that tonight my daughter has dance practice, so it is gonna be a busy, filled Monday, but that's okay. We got a lot to do, and I just wanna take you guys along. It's gonna be a great day, I just know it. It is already 10, 15, so we are dressed for the day. I have already changed the puppies out once this morning and fed them. And then Jolene has eight. Now it's time for her bath. She um, is a little stinky girl, so I'm just gonna clean her and give her a bath. Probably give her brother a quick bath as well, and then get everybody comfortable and get working. So yeah, I will talk to you guys soon. All right, bye. Say bye, Jojo. Say bye. You're so cute. Look at you. You're such a happy girl. Oh, stinky girl. You stinky girl. Yes. Yeah. I'm a little helper there. Hi, Jolene. Hi, sweetie. Hi, baby girl. All right, I got the puppy's pen all nice and cleaned out. I am moving it to the back room. Just because they're getting a little older, so they're getting a lot louder. And I figured since Jolene's bedroom isn't finished yet, all the way, I will bring their pen in here and therefore they won't get as excited so easily because it gets very loud. Right now I've been keeping them by the living room area and I'm hoping that this will just help minimize a lot of the loud barking. <laughs> they're very squeaky little things and we love them, but sometimes you just get almost a headache because it gets so loud. And I, I take them out to run around and stuff, but I just can't let them run 24 seven because they have a lot of accidents. They're still puppies. So anyways, I'm moving their pen back here. Okay. Here they are, two of them. They were just playing outside. Yes, these are my two girls. Yeah. Say hi, sweeties. Here we are starting off with some dishes in the kitchen. Jolene is sitting in her little boppy seat. She is a girl on the move. She's got places to be and things to do. She likes to sit up and look around. So I put her here on the counter so she could watch mama work and she is really enjoying it.
we use the Cascade Platinum for our dishes when we run them through the dishwasher. This is one of my favorite soaps. It doesn't leave residue behind or anything like that. Here I am spraying down the countertops with some Lysol cleaner. Tomorrow I am making pot roast, so I am leaving that out to unthaw. And here I am wiping down my cutting board. I just leave this out because I'm constantly cutting things up for myself or the kids. Now I'm adding a little Dawn dish soap and some nice warm water to my mop bucket so I can mop. The O-Cedar mop bucket is my favorite. Oh my goodness, you guys, I got an early Christmas gift and it is the Dyson cordless vacuum. This is my first time featuring it in one of my videos. I just got it a few days ago. I am so in love and so excited. This thing is literally amazing. I don't know how I have lived this long without it. Okay, now time for a quick mop. This O-Cedar mop bucket is my favorite. Once I started using this mop, I have never went back. I couldn't imagine using a regular sponge mop after using the O-Cedar mop. This thing will always be my favorite, favorite mop ever. Here I am wiping off the trim where the puppy pen has been sitting. Look how dirty that is. I just used some Lysol spray and paper towels and everything came right off. There was also a little bit of dirty stuff on the wall right there, which I cleaned off as well. Now I am going to go in with my O-Cedar mop and mop up the area where the pen had been sitting for so long and get it nice and clean. Oh, and now I gotta wipe off this Play-Doh from my son who was playing Play-Doh at the table just a bit ago. Snagged these Sam's Club wipes for a dollar a container at a store called Bailey's and I am using them to clean off my table. I got a couple containers of these wipes and they work amazing. Okay, you guys, it is time to start tidying up the living room. We're going to fold all the blankets up, get everything picked up, and then I'm going to wipe down the coffee table and the end tables. Over there is Layla entertaining her sister, Jojo. 
she is such a good big sister look at her oh she is doing some very interesting dance moves i just noticed she is such a goofy big sister but jolene loves her so so much for it Okay, now it is time to get my little Dyson vacuum here and start vacuuming the rug and the floor in the living room. Guys, just look at how amazing this vacuum works. Like, I am so in love. Like, this Dyson is just awesome. I literally never thought I could love a vacuum so much in my life, but it's true. I do. I love this Dyson. Okay, the living room area is <laughs> done. I just have to mop over Smelly. the wood part of the Mugudo. floor and everything. But look at Jolene. all the kids just hanging out on the <laughs> couch while I'm vacuuming. <laughs> There's Layla with her raspberries and Nutella. Oh There's gosh, little Jolene so with her little gangstaline. And then there's her brother over there yeah, trying to get a raspberry from his big sister. And of course, we also have our dog Millie just chilling on the couch. Everybody just looks so cute. I absolutely love it. We are just missing Aaliyah because she is not home from school yet. Now we are going to vacuum up and down the hallway with our Dyson cordless vacuum. Do I seem obsessed with this Dyson vacuum yet? Um, probably because I am. Here we are going to clean this air purifier. A friend of mine let me use this when I came home from the hospital with Jolene. I am going to invest in one of these because this thing is awesome and works amazing. Wait till you see all the dust and everything that it collected when I took off the outer layer. You're supposed to take this blue thing off and wash it. But yeah, the amount of dust on it, look at that, is disgusting. I am just going to wash this out in the sink with some Dawn soap and water and then squeeze it out, let it air dry for a few minutes and put it back on. Okay, now we are in the bathroom and I am just picking up everything and putting everything away where it needs to go.
here I am using the Favor brand dusting spray. This is pretty comparable to Pledge and works really good, you guys. Now for some finishing touches. Just got to go over with the Dyson and then we are going to give this little bathroom floor a quick mop with the O Cedar mop. Okay, here we are in my bedroom. We are going to make the bed and then just start tidying everything up. I am going to remove the stuff off of the end tables because they are pretty dirty as you can see and I'm going to use these disinfectant wipes just to wipe them down really good and hopefully kill any germs that could be sitting on them. And then I am also going to wipe down the ledge right here on the windowsill. Look at all that dust that's just from like literally two weeks guys and it got that dusty that quick. I got this fabric refreshing spray from Bailey's for 99 cents a can and this stuff smells so so good you guys. I literally bought like two cans. Hey guys, so I hope you enjoyed our cleaning video today. I did want to go over something with you. I got the new Dyson, my hubby got it me for me for Christmas. So he gave it to me early because he was just so excited to give it to me. And honestly, I was so excited to get it. I've been wanting one of these for like a couple years now. The lady who I clean house for has two of them and they are amazing and they've never broke down or anything in all my years of cleaning for her. It's been three and a half years that I've cleaned for her and those Dysons work amazing. So I wanna show you some of the attachments that the Dyson came with. Um, so yeah, Jolene and I are gonna show you really quick. Right, baby girl? All right, let's see. Um, it did come with this attachment. It has kind of like a velvet roller on it, which is more for like hardwood floors and more delicate surfaces so they don't get scratched or anything like that. This thing is amazing. I will be using this more on my new floors and everything just to kind of keep them from getting scratched up. I have used the regular one on my floors and that one works just fine as well. But yeah, I am gonna use this just to be a little more cautious with it. 
Um, I'm really happy that it came with that. Let's see, next up, this attachment is to do stairs and things like that. I have not used mine yet, but like I have used this before on the one that I use at the ladies' house I clean. And this thing is amazing for stairs, couches, everything. I'm actually gonna do my couches really quick and my stairs, so you will see that here at the end of the video. I will put the clip in. So excited to try this one out. Okay. We also have this little guy. It's an attachment and it also has like a little brush around it. This is really nice. I like that. Then there's this little guy attachment with a little brush, the little bristles at the end. I don't know, Dyson is just, when it comes to stick vacuums, rechargeable cordless stick vacuums, they take the cake. I don't know. I've had two other ones and yeah, they worked, but nothing like the Dyson. Like, I know I'm gonna have this thing for a good couple of years at least. Those other ones, like one of them stopped charging within like after six months of getting it. Um, like they were good brands too. Well, I think one was a Hoover and one was a Shark, but they just did not compare to the Dyson. I'm sorry, certain things, like I'm all about saving money, but with certain things you really do get what you pay for. And with the Dyson, you get what you pay for and more. Okay, also came with this little thing. I don't really know much about this. I'm gonna have to see. I have not really used it, but um, yeah, we will check it out. And then also this, so you can get like in little nooks, crannies, and corners. You can get like spider webs, little things from, you know, up high or down low crevices that it's harder to get into with the vacuum. It comes with this attachment, so really stoked about that. And then it also comes with the wall mount, which we're gonna mount ours, I think, on the side of these cabinets because the place I use it most is this kitchen and living room area is gonna be. So we're gonna put this little mount on the side of the cabinet here and yeah. It's going to be amazing. I cannot wait to hang it up and have it charging all the time. Um, I'm not going to lie. I am a little disappointed in the Roomba, but I'm probably still going to keep it anyways just to have for an extra little vacuum because I love my cleaning gadgets. It's not bad. It's just not the best. You know what I mean? It's not good for a deep vacuum. It's good for like just here and there in between things, I would say. And it constantly gets stuck on things. But yeah, so the Dyson is amazing. And now I'm the proud new owner of one. I just have to think of a name for her. Right, Jolene? We gotta name our Dyson. Yes, we do. <laughs> yes, we gotta give her a name. But yeah, so anyways, I will let you guys go and leave you with that because I have to take Layla to her dance class here soon. And, right, Mama? Gotta feed this little mama. She's ready to eat. So I'm gonna breastfeed her. And yeah. So mommy's gonna go back in them stairs real quick and then I gotta oh, feed mom, my Jolene. Mom, Jolene looks at me because I have to write $50 on her swing. <laughs> she yeah. says, what are you doing putting your doll in my swing? Yeah. Hey, if I am sleeping. Yeah, we're talking about <laughs> our vacuum. Mom, why are you talking about your vacuum? Jolene's grabbing my necklace. It is hot in here, yes. She's so smiling. Mom, can you cut the bell? Okay. Alrighty. Well, you guys have a good night and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Bye. Say bye, Jojo. Jolene sometimes does not like to let mommy out of her sight. So there she is sitting in her bumbo seat at the top of the stairs watching me vacuum. Here I am using the new attachment for the Dyson and it is just to help do like stairs and couches and things like that. And look how awesome and quick you can work with it.
I got this cute holiday rug from Bailey's for $3.99. They must have got this truckload from Marshall's because they were originally $16.99. They had tags on them that they were being sold at Marshall's. But I snagged this cute little tree rug for $3.99. Look how easy it is to empty the Dyson. You want to empty it after every use, you guys. Now I'm going to change out this diaper pail. Now that Jolene is home, I need to get it changed out so we can use it. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. And until next time, bye-bye.